It's fall down Friday. Railway strike could have been bad in Microsoft under the microscope. Arbitrage News Daily starts right now. Good morning, traders. Here's your Arbitrage News Daily for Friday, September 16, 2022. I'm Joshua Stark. Commuter rail services in the Los Angeles and San Francisco Bay areas would have been affected by a strike. The sound alert system in the Seattle area would have been forced to shutter. About 5,000 people ride sounder trains every day, down from about 20,000 before the pandemic. The Association of American Railroads, which represents the freight rail industry, estimates that about half of the commuter rail systems in the country depend on at least part of the tracks that are owned by the affected freight rail yards. John Klein, Director of Government Relations for the Coalition of Commuter Rail, said that it could have been potentially catastrophic. More after this. Why was the basketball court all wet? Because the players kept dribbling on it. <laughs> the dad joke. Corny, groan-worthy, but also one of the simplest ways to share a moment with your kids. What did the buffalo say when he dropped his son off for school? Bye, son. <laughs> so take a moment to make your kid laugh, because dad jokes rule. Make your kid laugh today. Go to fatherhood.gov. Brought to you by the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services and the Ad Council. Microsoft's $69 billion deal to buy video game company Activision Blizzard faces an in-depth antitrust investigation in Britain after the tech company refused to offer proposals to ease competition concerns. Britain's Competition and Markets Authority said Thursday that it was referring the blockbuster deal for more scrutiny under a so-called Phase 2 investigation. The watchdog said that based on the available information, the deal may be expected to result in a substantial lessening of competition in the United Kingdom. Your Fall Down Friday focus markets and sells insurance products and services in the United States, Bermuda, Canada, Ireland, the United Kingdom, and the Cayman Islands. It operates through four segments, retail, national programs, wholesale brokerage, and services, Brown and Brown stock symbol BRO starts at 6530, but it won't be there for long. More after this. I'm 54, so it's too late to start saving for retirement, right? Uh, not right. Starting to save, even in your 50s, can really make a difference. Right now, saving seems hard to wrap my head around. AARP makes it easy. Go to aceyourretirement.org and chat with Avo, the friendly digital retirement coach. It's free and only takes three minutes. I like three minutes. Answer some questions and get personalized tips to help boost your retirement savings. Thanks. Just head to aceyourretirement.org. That's aceyourretirement.org. A message from AARP and the Ad Council. The answer to our riddle yesterday, Mary and Jackie went on a vacation. They both got two separate hotel rooms. The rooms have no heating, and Jackie was really cold, but Mary was not. Without adding any clothing or wrapping herself in any other material, using anything for fire, what did Mary do to stay warm in that cold, empty room? Answer, Mary huddled in the corner of the room where it's always 90 degrees. Think about it. We'll see you tomorrow for Arbitrage Weekend. Arbitrage Trade Analytics, LLC, is a privately held market research company. Arbitrage Trade Analytics, LLC, is solely responsible for the preparation and distribution of the content of this podcast. The opinions offered in this podcast are for informational purposes only and are not intended to be investment advice. Seek a duly licensed professional for investment advice. For more information about the informational research and services offered by Arbitrage Trade Analytics, LLC, please visit arbitragetrade.com.